Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question guys. So this question belongs to GATE CSE 2011. Okay. So the question is, uh, there are four different matrices M1, M2, M3 and M4 of dimensions P cross Q, Q cross R, R cross S and S cross T. Okay. Respectively can be multiplied in several ways with a different number of two scalar multiplications. Okay. So for example, when multiplications are done, M1 cross M2 cross M3 cross M4. So basically this is done first and this is done first. Then the total number of multiplications is a PQR plus RST plus PQ, P, PRT where the multiplications is a M1 cross M2 cross M3. So it depends on that thing, right? Yes. So now the question is we need to find the minimum value, right? Yes. So in simple words, you can say this is a type of a matrix chain multiplication question, guys. So basically, we discussed multiple questions like around one question. <laughs> it's not multiple. We discussed one question in our theoretical classes in detail, guys, if you ask me, right? Yes. So that is the reason why let us now go through this question and let us understand. So first, let us draw the matrix. So we are having four matrices, right? So M1, M2, M3. M4. So here they are asking only the result. So there is no need of constructing the other matrix guys. Okay. M1, M2, M3, M4. So let us draw this particular matrix. You can say. Okay. Yes. So remember one thing. So if I and J both are equal, that is nothing but you are doing, you are trying to do M1 cross M1. Will you do it? No. So that is the reason why this answers will be zero and below values are need not to be calculated. Got it? Yes. So in total, we are in, we are required to calculate one, two, three, four, five and six values only. So this is a simple problem guys. If you ask me, okay. Yes. So let us write down these values. First of all, so it is a 10, 100, 20, five and 80, right? Yes. So let us try to solve at M2. So if we are multiplying M2 with M1, what will be the thing guys? Just recall. Okay. So we tried the ladder method, right? So basically you will multiply this. Sorry, you will add this with this and you will multiply the requirements, right? Yes. So zero plus zero plus you will multiply the first three elements, right? That is nothing but, okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. So what you will do, you will exactly multiply them, right? So it is a nothing but 10 cross 100 cross 20, right? Yes. So you can just solve it guys. Okay. So the result will be 10. So I think the flashlight is not having some issue. So 10 cross 100 into 20. So the result will be 20,000 guys. You can just calculate with the calci. Okay. So 20,000. 1, 2, 3. Okay. So if you calculate at this point, it will be 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus, 0 plus the next 3 values. That is 100. Guys, if you are confusing like how I am doing it, please watch the theoretical class guys because I have clearly explained it there. Okay. So for this, the result will be 100 into 20 into 5. So the result is 10,000. Okay. So for this, we got 10,000. So let us try for this. So again, add so for this, right? So add these two. So zero plus a zero plus. A, so the values of last three, that is a 20 into five into eight. So it is a 8,000. So the value will be 8,000. Okay. So now let us calculate here. Okay. So once you came to upper level, so again, you will add this and you will add this, right? Yes. So you will take this value and you will add with that, right? So zero plus a 10,000. Okay. Plus a, you will start multiplying now, right? Yes. So the first multiplication will be this and let us write the next value also. So it is 20,000 plus zero plus let us start. So here you will write 10, here you will write 10, here you will write 100, here you will write 100, here you will write 20, sorry, here you will write 20, here you will write 5, right? Here you will write 5. So now if you calculate among these two, which is the minimum value you should check, right? Yes. So let me solve it. So it is a nothing, sorry, it is nothing but a 10 into 100 into 5. So this value is a 5,000 plus 10,000. The result will be 15,000 for this, right? Yes. Similarly, for the below value, it is a 10 into 20 into 5 is equals to plus 20,000. So the below result will be 21,000. So which is a cheap guys, 15,000 is cheap. So here the result will be 15,000. So in the same way, using the same logic of upper arrows or upper ladders, you can say. So if we calculate here, it is for the first one, it will be 
zero plus eight thousand, right? And the below one, it will be ten thousand plus zero. Okay. So if you try to add our logic, so it is a hundred, hundred. It is a twenty, and it is a five. It is a eighty, and it is eighty. You will be multiplying them. Okay. So let us start. So hundred into twenty into eighty. Is equals to sixteen thousand plus eight thousand. Okay, so it is a sorry, it's eight thousand, right? Oh, sorry, it's eight thousand or eighty thousand. Okay, so it is eight thousand. Assume in that way. So the result will be so. Let us calculate it again. Sorry, hundred into two twenty into eighty. Okay, so it is a sixteen thousand plus eight thousand, guys. It is not eighty thousand. It's eight thousand. So sixteen eight du triple double zero, right? Yes. So what about the below value? It is a hundred into five into eighty, right? Is it plus thousand, ten thousand? Sorry. Okay. Yes. So it is ten thousand. My bad. So the result will be. Okay. Just give me a second. So it is hundred into five into eight, right? It is a four thousand. So four thousand plus ten thousand. The result will be fourteen thousand, right? Yes. So here the minimum value among these two is fourteen thousand. So fourteen thousand will come here. So similarly, you can calculate at that point also, right? So I will just give me a second. I will take a piece of paper. Okay. So again, now the ladder has been upgraded a lot. So the first value will be zero plus fourteen hundred. Sorry, fourteen thousand. Okay. Similarly, the next value will be twenty thousand plus eight thousand. The third value will be fifteen thousand plus zero, right? So on the other hand, the values will be. Let us start writing the chain. So it is a ten, ten, ten. The middle value will be hundred, twenty, and five. The last value will be eighty, eighty, and eighty. Okay. So let us calculate this. Sorry for that. So the first value will be ten into hundred into eighty is equals to eighty thousand plus fourteen thousand. Okay. So the first value will be ninety four thousand. Okay. So the second value, so ten into twenty into eighty, is equals to sixteen thousand plus eight thousand plus twenty thousand, is equals sorry, is equals to. So the second answer will be forty four thousand. So let us check the last option. That is a ten into five into eighty, is equals to four thousand plus fifteen thousand. The answer will be nineteen thousand. So among these three, which is the minimum, guys, is nineteen thousand. So at the end, the total matrix multiplications we are going to do is nineteen thousand multiplications. If you do, you will get the answer. Got it? Yes. So the answer will be C. So it's a quite simple problem, but it's a bit lengthy problem, guys. So the only thing is you should concentrate on calculations, and it's a two mark question, guys. So it's a bit valuable if you ask me. Okay? Yes. So now I hope everyone got a clear idea, right? So how exactly we have solved, guys? If you are having some confusions with this, please watch the theoretical class, guys. So I have told you how you can calculate it really fastly. So it might take some more time, but you will, you are going to get the correct answer. So that's important, right? Yes. So I hope everyone got a clear idea on this question. So in the next lecture, let us continue with the next question. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe for more awesome videos like this. Thank you.